In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to obtain and upgrade the Hand of Hamera on the Black Ops 4 Zombies map Ancient Evil. Now to do this, you will first need a Dormant Hand. This item has 20 possible spawn locations, so I made a separate video showing them all which you can find in the description. That is the first step. Once you have that, head over to the Hamera Shrine located in the Monument of Craterus which is on the right side of the marketplace. What you have to do is give the Shrine your Dormant Hand to begin a lockdown. When you do this, you'll be trapped inside the circle and must kill glowing yellow zombies to get out. There's about 10 zombies you'll have to kill and you should be able to get through this if you use your equipment and specialist. After that, the circle will close and you can pick up the fallen hand of Hamera. Now to upgrade it, you must deliver three orbs of light to the shrine. This is done by adjusting three mirrors around the map and shooting them with the fallen hand so an orb of light ricochets into a bowl. You want to try and angle these mirrors so they look completely vertical. You can do this by shooting them with the regular gun. Once it's aligned, shoot it with the fallen hand and the orb will appear in a nearby bowl. To collect the orb, simply melee it. The first mirror can be found on the outside of a Apollo's temple. For this one, I usually align and shoot it from its bowl location, which is outside the gymnasium bathhouse. From there, try and get to the shrine as fast as possible before the orb fades. If it does fade, simply shoot another orb and try again. Once at the shrine, melee either the left, right, or center bowl. The second mirror is on this bridge outside the upper road area. Shoot the mirror from the bridge, melee the bowl, and then make your way to the shrine. Again, this one is pretty close, so you should be able to get there in time if you cut through the amphitheater area. And the final mirror is located out in the temple terrace area. You can align and shoot this one from right below it. Once you're ready, melee the bowl, then run through spawn and all the way to the shrine. This is probably the farthest one, but it's still possible to do without stamina. Once you've placed an orb in all three bowls on the shrine, a portal will open up. For the final step of the upgrade, you must prove yourself worthy by using the redeemed hand against a small wave of zombies. The upgrade gives you a unique charge attack that directs a beam of light anywhere you look. These shots can be hard to do when zombies get too close, so spamming the trigger works just as well. After you kill everything, you'll be teleported back to the map. Another Another cool thing with these gauntlets is you can return them to their shrines and also take them back anytime you want. Well that's pretty much it for this video so thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.